Hey, what's happening guys? Zach Sickich here, founder of Pro Arbor Training, and I'm back for another installment of our weekly video tip. This week we're gonna be talking about D goalie communication. So we're gonna be using two calls here, guys. Very simple, there's multiple calls that we could add, but for today's video, we're working on two calls. First off, if the D-man wants the goalie to stop the puck, he or she is going to yell, set, 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 set. If the D-man wants the goalie to not stop the puck, just leave it in the corner, you're going to yell, mine, mine, mine. The D's going to yell, mine, mine, mine to the goalie. So that's those are the two calls that we're going to be using here, guys. Let's watch our goaltenders use these two calls with the D-man. Check it out. Hey, what's happening guys? Switched up the setting on here to get your attention. Now I'm gonna ask you a question. What is the most common thing that we hear defensemen say to the goalies the most and this thing is ambiguous? It can mean one of two things. Think about it. D-men, coaches, we hear the words leave it, leave it, leave it a lot. Now as a goalie, leave it could mean stop it and leave it alone or leave it alone and don't touch it at all. So D-men, Coaches, don't use the words leave it. Leave that one in the past, all right? I want you guys to switch right now to set if you want the goalies to stop the puck and mine if you want the goalies not to stop the puck. There you have it, guys. Back to the video. Boom. Go. There you have it guys, a few simple communication tips for the D-man to talk to you for an effective way to break the puck out of the zone. Remember, the two calls that we're working on right now are set, set, set. That means stop the puck for the defenseman, set it up for him. And the second call is mine, mine, mine. That means don't touch the puck at all. Let that D-man come through with speed. Share these videos with your D-man, share them with your coaches, work on them in practice, so then their habits and games. Looking forward to bringing the next video to you guys next week.